Firearm sales reached an all-time high in 2020 as Americans anticipated the possibility of additional gun control measures under a Joe Biden administration. In 2021, gun sales could be in for another banner year given investors' reaction to the capital riots. The stocks for several major gun manufacturers have risen sharply after rioters supporting President Donald Trump stormed the Capitol building Wednesday and interrupted certification of Biden as the next president. While gun sales data in the time since the violence is not yet available, the stock price increases for gun makers suggest investors believe 2021 will be another strong year. The movement also comes amid concerns about further violence as Inauguration Day approaches January 20. Tough times, fewer than 4 in 10 Americans could pay for an emergency $1,000 expense social security tip. How to increase your retirement income by $9,500 annually shares of Vista Outdoor, Stern, Rugeco, and Smith Wesson increased immediately after Wednesday afternoon's attacks. From Wednesday morning's market open through Monday's close, they were up about 10%, 4% and 2%, respectively. Smith Wesson had risen 12% by Monday morning but relinquished some of those gains in the afternoon. By contrast, the SP500 rose 2% during that stretch. It's unclear whether investors believe gun manufacturers will benefit from Trump supporters purchasing weapons, general concern among other Americans about civil unrest, both or other reasons. Industry leaders have not weighed in. Representatives for Vista, Ruger and Smith Wesson did not respond to requests seeking comment. Mark Oliver, Director of Public Affairs for the National Shooting Sports Foundation, the Firearm Industries Trade Association, declined to comment on the possibility that the Capitol riots jilted gun sales, but he condemned the attack as an American. The destruction of the U.S. Capitol was as shocking and abhorrent to the members of the National Shooting Sports Foundation as it was to the rest of the nation, he said in an email. The violence visited upon the cradle of democracy and the law enforcement officers protecting it was reprehensible. In 2020, gun sales reached nearly 23 million, up from the previous record of 16.6 million in 2016, according to estimates by Small Arms Analytics Forecasting a research consultancy. FBI data on instant background checks for gun purchases, a metric generally viewed as a proxy for real-time gun sales, is reported monthly. FBI spokesperson Holly Morris said January data would not be available until early February. The National Rifle Association, which represents the interests of gun owners, declined to comment for this story. Follow USA Today reporter Nathan Boomi on Twitter at Nathan Boomi.